that baby monitor you trust to keep your child safe might be exposing them to electromagnetic radiation levels equivalent to standing 50 to 100 meters from a cell phone tower. Independent laboratory testing has found that popular baby monitors emit radiation that exceeds international safety guidelines for adults, yet they're routinely placed just feet away from developing infant brains. Recent studies have also revealed that wireless radiation from baby monitors significantly disrupts sleep patterns, affecting the very rest they're supposed to protect. What's happening in your nursery while you think you're protecting your baby might shock you. Baby monitors are marketed as essential safety devices, with advertisements showing peaceful sleeping babies and reassuring parents. The packaging emphasizes features like crystal clear audio and long range connectivity, but nowhere will you find warnings about electromagnetic radiation exposure. Here's what manufacturers don't tell you. To achieve that long range signal and clear audio quality, digital baby monitors use the same 2.4 gigahertz frequency as Wi-Fi routers and microwave ovens. But unlike these devices, baby monitors are specifically designed to be placed directly next to your most vulnerable family member. Independent testing by the Environmental Working Group found that some baby monitors produce radiation levels of 35,000 microwatts per square meter when placed three feet from the device. According to the Building Biology Institute, this creates exposure levels equivalent to standing 50 to 100 meters from a cell phone tower. What makes this particularly concerning is that infant skulls are thinner and their brain tissue more conductive than adults. The radiation absorption rate in a child's brain can be up to 10 times higher than in adult tissue, according to research published in the Journal of Microscopy and Ultrastructure. A groundbreaking 2024 study published in Environmental Health News found that wireless radiation from baby monitors significantly disrupts sleep patterns, specifically affecting non-rapid eye movement and REM sleep the deep sleep crucial for infant brain development. Here's where it gets infuriating. Many European countries have implemented stricter electromagnetic radiation standards, specifically for devices used around children. France has banned Wi-Fi in nurseries and daycare centers for children under three, while Germany recommends against using baby monitors altogether. The United States has no specific safety standards for infant exposure to electromagnetic radiation. The FCC's safety guidelines were established in 1996 and are based on adult male physiology, completely ignoring the unique vulnerability of developing children. Meanwhile, the baby monitor industry has grown into a billion-dollar market with virtually no oversight regarding radiation exposure. Companies continue to increase transmission power to improve range and audio quality, making newer models potentially more dangerous than older ones. The good news is that electromagnetic radiation follows the inverse square law. Doubling the distance reduces exposure by 75%. Moving a baby monitor from three feet to six feet away from your baby's crib reduces radiation exposure by four times. At 10 feet, most baby monitors drop to radiation levels similar to Wi-Fi routers. At 15 feet, exposure becomes minimal while still providing effective monitoring. Simply repositioning your monitor can reduce your baby's exposure by up to 90%. Even better alternatives exist wired baby monitors eliminate electromagnetic radiation entirely while still providing audio monitoring. Low-power audio-only monitors emit 90% less radiation than video models. And, for parents who want video monitoring, placing the monitor across the room rather than next to the crib dramatically reduces exposure. Some parents are choosing intermittent monitoring, turning the monitor on only when needed rather than running it continuously. This reduces cumulative exposure while still providing peace of mind during critical sleep periods. Your baby monitor doesn't have to be a source of hidden radiation exposure. With simple positioning changes and informed choices, you can maintain the safety monitoring you want while dramatically reducing electromagnetic exposure.
The key is understanding that distance is your friend. Wired alternatives exist, and continuous high-power monitoring isn't necessary for keeping your baby safe. Being an informed parent means knowing what you're bringing into your nursery. If this revelation about baby monitor radiation opened your eyes to hidden dangers in everyday products, hit subscribe for more videos that expose the truth behind things marketed as safe for your family.